I'm Agnès de la Borde. I'm a research engineer for the French Laboratory for Metrology and Testing, the LNE. Uh, well, no need to go over there. In this community, there is on one side supply in AI, on the other side there are customers in AI, and there, there is a strong need for evaluation and certification, amongst other needs, naturally, we all know about them. In my own activity, I'm with the uh, department from l &E. um, Yes, I stopped moving for the camera. <laughs> Uh, dedicated so on testing uh, of AI, and this department is involved in the program uh, program Confiance AI. But we also have another activity at LNE. We are a certification organization. So when I say certification in organization, it means we are authorized under the ISO. 17065 uh, to create um, reference um, standards for certification and also to certify products from the industry. In the idea of certifying AI, we know that there are several approaches that are discussed. Uh, there are pros and cons. Uh, you may certify the processes uh, of development, for example, in AI. You can certify the product AI product itself, you can also certify, certify people. In our context, uh, we started two years ago uh, a program for the creation of a certification standard and our option was to uh, dedicate it to processes of, for AI. It's, uh, so you can uh, find it, well it's available on the web, you just either copy paste this or you type it on Google, it will be easy to find. The overview of the certification, so you understood it's on the processes, uh, this is what we are certifying. This is a voluntary certification, meaning that there is, and we know, no regulation that asks you to have this certification. Uh, we made the choice uh, to dedicate it on machine learning applications and, well, on the focus of the certification, it's the processes that are covered. I'll briefly talk about them. So the idea, uh, the certification started, it was, it's operational. Uh, it became operational last year in September. We took one year to design it. It was like any uh, certification reference. It was a collaborative work with stakeholders. Here are the four processes that are certified. So we've got the design process, so when you are designing the specification of the AI, you've got the development process, the evaluation process, so evaluation, it's the evaluation of AI, and also the maintenance in operational condition process. So these four items can be certified. The highlights, like in any certification or regulation, well, it's, so, it's common. Uh, we don't fix any desired technical solution uh, so as not to be limitative in terms of innovation, but we um, impose objectives to be rich, obje objectives in terms of quality, control, monitoring, etc. Uh, we make a big focus on the documentation and justification. Here it is required that everything is well documented and justified. There is an importance on information of all those that are concerned in the ecosystem and we take the ecosystem at large, so meaning the needs and the express of interest from the consumers, uh, customers, sorry, the users, the regulation, etc., that apply to the AI product. We also naturally take into account uh, the importance of the risk, so the criticity of the risk uh, linked to the AI product that is being developed. Here I go really quick, it doesn't really matter. The only thing here is uh, the fact that it's based on an audit. We've got documentation that we inspect and we have an audit on site where our experts uh, interact with the experts from uh, the industry site. 
industrial site. Side, oh sorry. Uh, the certification, it's you're certified for three years, but each year you've got to have a small audit. And as for the key elements, I'll go quickly on that, and more than quickly, I'm going to skip them because we're running out of time. All the detail is in the document that is available online. And I'll just make a focus here on what is important for all processes. So the importance of documentation, not only documentation for us um, to read, but also documentation internally between the processes to ensure a constant flow of information in um, the industry. Uh, we also make a focus on determining all the resources that are important in order to achieve uh, the goals in each process. So the resources, so human, material, etc. An important, I said it previously, uh, but it's really important, on the risks. Uh, all the risks must be identified um, by the candidate to the certification. They must be identified and they must evolve. So at the design process, you've got risks, identify, identified. Um, after doing the evaluation, normally you have updated uh, your understanding of the risks associated to the AI and the importance well. First thing, your processes must follow good practice, but you must uh, as well evaluate them, constantly uh, improve your processes. One uh, other important point uh, of the certification is uh, the production of a product sheet. It's in the same idea of conveying all the important information to the Mm, relevant stakeholders. So we call it the product sheet and it details many, many aspects of um, the AI product and the processes. In the next step, steps, uh, our certification, so it was created two years ago, we know that a lot of things are moving really fast on every domain, including regulation. So naturally our standard is going to evolve to follow the steps the state-of-the-art uh, standards as well that are going to, bri to bring really good uh, information and also, well, the expectations from regulation. And on a side note, just to inform you, it has not been announced yet, but uh, each year, each year, well, it's the second edition only, but each year, um, LNE organizes a forum on artificial intelligence. We've got the date, now, now it's settled. Uh, and we've asked already some of you to be part of it uh, as presenters. Uh, so it's going to be on the 6th of December. It's soon going to be announced on our website and on social media. Uh, so please keep an eye on it and we will make a focus without surprise on the regulation in all domains for AI. Thanks a lot. <laughs>